Yo, yo, man, what's up? Your boy, Positive Flow. Good morning to you. Man, just got through putting everything back in the beast, as you can see, baby. <laughs> it's ready to roll, man. I got of a uh, maximum to do tomorrow. Uh, he traded this Infinity in and got him a maximum. So, you know, my customers always trading their cars in for another car. And they call me and say, hey, man, I just got me another car, man. I need for you to hook me up. So, you know, it is what it is, you know. But uh, that was a good question. A guy emailed me yesterday. Like I said, I can't get to all my emails. Uh, I apologize, you guys. Let me fix this camera here. I, follow, I apologize, you guys. Can't get to everybody. But uh, he was asking me about a tank. You know, uh, should I go with a big tank, Mr. Jones? Should I go with a um, little tank? It all depends on you. Um, you know, how much work are you planning on doing? Uh, me, I just do it part-time. I tell anybody that. You know, I may do one car before I go into work. Depends on uh, daylight savings time. I may do two cars. Depends on how I feel. Uh, the weekend, I take care of my VIPs. I may go do two and come on back, you know, because that's the wife's weekend. So uh, it all depends on what's your beast mode. I always say that. Go back way back to one of my videos. What's your beast mode? Are you one of them hustlers that you're going to continue to grind day in, day out? Or you like me, you debt free. You ain't got to grind that hard. You know, you go out and make you a couple of hundred bucks, you good. You know, uh, on the average, you know, I average about 200 bucks a day. You know, uh, but then in the summertime when I'm doing boats, that's where your money is. If you can get into boats, that's where your money is. You know, uh, you can do 10 cars, 15 cars, and I beat you on one boat. That's what I mean. That's where the money is when it comes for the boats. <laughs> But as you can see, that's a 50 gallon tank that I got installed. You know, I always cross strap it. Some people use ratchet uh, where you just pull it and it tightens down. I really don't like those because as the van moves, vibration, uh, those type of straps, they loosen up. And, uh, you know, your tank might slide on you. So I like to use the, uh, the, the crank down type I use the thick type uh, the yellow ones uh, they come in pretty good um, pretty good sizes uh, on those straps you know it'll tell you um, how much weight it will hold so be careful you know get the right the right kind of straps you know uh, for safety purposes you know but anyway uh, out of a 50 gallon tank I normally get about maybe three four cars out of that you know but in essence, I'm saving gas as well. You know, I don't waste a lot of gas. I'm not a wasteful person. Uh, anybody that knows me, they'll tell you, hey, you know, this guy don't waste too much money, you know, unless it's gonna bring him more money. Uh, I'm a very conservative person, man, when it comes to uh, buying things. I only buy, and I ask myself before I buy it, how is this gonna hinder my future? Is this gonna make me more money or is this just making me feel good at this moment? That's how I make decisions. <laughs> you know, it was a hard habit to break <laughs> when I first started because you know, I used to buy anything I wanted. I, I worked for it, but I was broke. <laughs> oh, watch out there now. But yeah, man, uh, if you get a, like I had a 225 gallon tank. That's about 1800 pounds worth of water, man. And I'm carrying around in my van you know, uh, that gas hand, you'll see it. It'll be full. And all of a sudden, you'll see that sucker go. It'll start moving on you. <laughs> but my 50-gallon tank, man, I can fill it up. And, you know, I ride a week, week and a half, you know, because right now, you know, my van was empty. I, You know, my van is a six-cylinder. And I rode without anything in it for two weeks. You know, I filled it up two weeks ago. But of course, you know, I don't go that far. You know, like I try to tell guys, um, I've set myself up to where I don't have to travel that far. You know, 10 minutes tops from my house. That's as far as I'm going to go. Uh, in the area that I live in, everything is in my area that I want to grasp for us business-wise. And I'm still thinking of a little more ideas to where I can tack on to my business. 
So you constantly want to remind yourself or look around when you're driving around your city, look around and say, hmm, what do people want? It ain't what they need. Back in my day, you only did what bought or got what you needed. Nowadays, people will go broke to get what they want. I'm not one of those people. That's just me. But I hope that answered your question about the uh, tank, my man. Um, depends on how much work that you're planning on doing. That's what size of tank that you get. How often are you going to do cars? Are you going to do them every day or are you going to do it like me? I got VIP customers. If, if, if I'm not doing my VIP customers, I'm chilling like a villain. I'm on back of my dick barbecue <laughs> spending time with my, 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 my teddy bear. You know, my wife and I, we're real close, you know, we, uh, uh, we unsep unseparatable, you know what I mean? So that's what I'm down, you know, I spend time with my wife, you know what I mean? I really love my wife, I mean, she's always been there for me. So I show her that mutual respect and take her wherever she wants to go and uh, make sure she's taken care of. So uh, you guys be cool, man. Uh, I'm going I'm gonna, I'm gonna to get out tomorrow and do my car, uh, my customer's car, and... Um, I'm going to try to film it depends on what time I get out because they like the savings time. It's not kicked in yet. So don't forget I got to go to work. So that window in between there, you know. It seems like I'm always rushing, but I'm not. So you guys be cool, man. Deuces.